Amy Blocker is one of our career specialists um, here at Nantricon, and she works one-on-one -on -one with folks who are seeking a job and helps them. One of the things she helps with is developing their resume. So Amy, if you could um, give us some tips, that'd be great. Okay. Good morning. And um, I would like to start off about talking about resumes. So <clears throat> what is a resume? A resume is a marketing tool that job seekers use to communicate their value to employers. What is not a resume? A resume is not a job application and it's not a biography about your life. What to include on your resume? You wanna put all your personal information, your, your full name, your complete contact information, um, your education, your work experience, the skills that you have, the accomplishments that you have made, and other relevant information like training courses you've completed or community involvement that you're in. What not to include on a resume. You don't want to put your age, your religion, your marital status, not every job you've ever had. In some cases, if you had a job 20 years ago that's not relevant to what you're doing now, you might not want to put that in there. And you don't want to put your salary expectations or other requirements that you might have. Get ready to write your resume. So you're going to identify your transferable skills, gather all of your history and accomplishments. What are transferable skills? Transferable skills are the skills you acquire in a variety of settings that will be applicable to an employment situation. Even if you don't have much work experience, you probably have more transferable skills than you realize. Writing tips. Put the most important points at the top of the page. Highlight your transferable skills. Use proper tense, past tense for things that you've done in the past, present things present tense for the things you're currently doing. Showcase your accomplishments to point out your value. Use action words and bullet points. Identify your accomplishments, something you've learned, improved on, or helped with. Important things to remember. You will need your resume throughout your life. Keep track of it and keep it in an editable format. Do an annual edit adding accomplishments and updating certifications. Remember you can tailor your resume to specific jobs. Remember that your resume will be read by a computer first in many instances. So you wanna make sure you're using those key skill words like customer service, CDL, forklift, maintenance, all those skills that you know. So be positive. You may get that job you thought you never would apply for and in the end it's your dream job. And as a career specialist here at Mantracon, I enjoy helping the people in our communities that need job search assistance, helping customers write resumes, revamping a resume, being the best job coach on your side. So please feel free to contact me anytime for your assistance on your career path. And my information is listed below. All right, thank you, Amy. You're we appreciate welcome. that. So we would encourage you to contact us at Mantracon if you need help with that job search. If you want some help practicing for a job interview, maybe you haven't had to do a job interview in a long time. You just wanna brush up on that. Um, if you need some help developing your resume, if you just aren't sure what kind of things you would be good at in a job, uh, we can give you some um, assessments that will help you know, help you define what your interests are and your skills are and, and match that up with a career path for you. So we would really encourage you to visit our website, mantracon.org, or call us at 618-998-0970 and say that you're a job seeker needing help 